Hey guys, in today's video, we got a game with Charlie to start it off. We can see just how broken this brawler is. I didn't even play well, but the brawler's just so overpowered. Definitely an EU lobby with composure. Unless it's fake, but I don't think there's a fake one. But if it is, it's free code promotion for him, so I guess so. But probably him, so don't want to throw, don't want to mess him up. Ban Crow, although now Charlie. Charlie's not banned, that's not great. Do either of these guys have Charlie? He doesn't have Charlie. He doesn't have Charlie. Alright, that's really bad. So no matter what, they get Charlie, because surely one player on their team has Charlie, right? Taking a while, they're, they're thinking it through. Alright, Lola. M's into Lola's can be alright, I guess. It just depends. If the Lola is hitting their shots, it's going to be hard, but if they don't, it's fine. Rosa. Rosa this early. I guess Lou is banned. Now we're really worried about Charlie. I think we... Nobody really counters Charlie is the problem. We have a B. So Charlie absolutely murders our comp. I mean, I'm not going to pull up Squeak when I haven't seen two of their picks. I understand you want me to pick it, but you got to see their other two picks first. Come on. If, if this last guy does not pick Charlie, I'll be in absolute shock. Like, surely you picked Charlie here. You have two perf- I, I understand, but let me, let me let me think. I'm not going to pick Squeak and Danita. That's, like, not a good pick at all. Like, I want to go Charlie. No, I don't want to go Squeak. Charlie will just destroy them. They have no mid. And Charlie drops the gems with the super. So I don't, I don't think Squeak... I mean, Squeak is good into... Lola for sure, and it's all right into Gale. Probably a little better, but Squeak is so bad into Nita. Like, I can't kill the bear, especially with shield and healing. The bear will never die. And Charlie's a pretty good aggro lane, because they don't have, except for Nita, they don't really have the crowd control to get my spiders down. But I am on delay, which is going to be really annoying. All right, so they've got the Nita this way. Should have the vision gear. I'm gonna pop those out so we can see. Right. They're pushing me, I think. Alright, I'm dead. But the rose is doing alright. I feel like those are not good bushes, though. That's just gonna result in us getting rushed. Alright, you kill him there, alright, no, maybe, so. Alright, this Gale is actually so annoying, I hate this star power. And I, I don't like the bushes we've made at all, because it just makes the Nita destroy us, right? Not a fan of these bushes. And I can't even get like a super. Like, do I want to go in on Nita? I mean, I can destroy the bear, at least. Alright, we can get him. Alright, and get that kill. Alright, and kill him. Alright, we'll trap him, at least. Like, I want to just stop him from being alive when he comes back. So, Charlie is just so OP, and that's why we always pick Charlie. Like, even when I play horrible, like I'm playing so badly, the Charlie is just good. I guess Composure doesn't like the other team or something, but seems to be some toxicity going on there. But I I think the Rosa should have some better bushes or not even be on the bush gadget. Like it's it's nice, but if we lose control then they just get such good like positioning. I think I wanna run at the Nita to be honest. Or run at the Lola or whatever because, like, with delay, it's so annoying to like try and check the bushes and stuff. 
It's like such a pain. Danita's definitely flanking right now. Yeah. Okay, we'll just do that then. I think we'll like put up spiders maybe. Yeah, okay. I don't I don't know how this got their playtesting. This is just so stupid. Like, and how are these people? Why is nobody banning Charlie? Like, I don't do it because I ra I just br ban brawlers I don't like playing against and sleep banning the best ones, usually. Like, I'm just gonna... Oh, I missed it. That's bad. I'm just gonna spam check here. Okay. Like, we're gonna lose so much control here. Except Rosa's gonna have hypercharge super, so we're fine. I can just kill that really fast. It's fine if he dies, I don't see how they really get it. Oh, he wasted hypercharge so badly there. See, this is the problem with the bushes, like how do we ever push up here, and why are you grabbing the gems? Alright, I killed one of them. Like, don't run into the Nita because you just feed the super every time. Alright, we're in a better spot now. Alright, we've reset countdown by doing that. Alright, he's got 11, get 11, get 11, get 11. Alright, I think we're good. This Charlie's so stupid. I don't understand how this brawler got through playtesting, like, at all. Alright, that's one down. That's the other killed. Yeah, I mean, Charlie's just so good, because I can just put one in the thing, instant 2v3 for so long. Alright, I guess we don't like the Lola. Max kudos? No. We're fine. Um, well, we're like halfway back to Legendary 3, recovering the tilt. I'll take it. We got last stop, NA Lobby, thankfully. Uh, if no one else is going to ban Charlie, I'll ban it. I don't really have a brawl I like banning too much. I do ban Crow, but I think it's fine not to. Yeah, definitely Nani. No, 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 Nani, Nani, Nani. I feel like Nani is just so, like, unbeatable. It's just so frustrating because he like counters tanks because they can't go in on him and he also counters sharpshooters because he one shots them. He also counters throwers because he wall breaks and curves around walls. It's like the only thing that counters him is mobility. So like I think Crow's a good pick for them right now because it's mobility. You could go Stu. It's a little early to go Stu though because we still have two picks to counter. You go Tara. Tara, I think I might want to go M's. We'll see though. Depends on what they pick. All right, Lou, you can go Spike. That's fine. I don't know what to do to counter Lou, to be honest. I think Jesse could actually be pretty good because they do have a Tara. Hmm. No, I'm not picking Carl into Lou or Tara. I mean, Carl's good to Tara until first super. No, I think M's. To be honest. No, I don't want to go either of those. I'm going to stick with M's. Because M's actually counters Tara so well. And I can juke Delu around. And this also prevents tanks. Um, although I guess we do already have the spike. So I think Jesse might have been a better pick. But we'll see. I've kind of had mixed results with Jesse on this map. So we'll find out if it was the right pick or not. I like... Um, Buster's good. Buster's good. If I had picked Jesse, they definitely would have gone Buster. It's going to be hard to get him out of there, but once we do, it's really hard for him to get back in. And if I go left, no one's really going to stop me on the left, because they outrange the Tara. Somehow, like, I, I feel like Tara should outrange M's, but somehow M's always gets sets off on Tara. He's going to take the jump pad, which is going to be really annoying, because I need the jump pad. Like, you that way. Yeah. With speed gear, if I can just get up into here. Yeah. I mean, I can just auto some shots on him. 
that's a very interesting super. I think if our Nani had more awareness, we'd have been in a better spot. Alright, we've got the kill, and now the control is what we want. We've got the gems, we've got the control. Probably gonna solo pull me, yep. Okay, very interesting pull. He didn't even get the kill. That might have been a very bad gadget, but I'd rather keep control than die to a pet and lose it all. Alright, I'll just do that. I don't. They're not attacking our mid at all, which is fine. I think they're trying to like aggress up. And they haven't, they didn't take over my lane, so I'm still safe in here. It seems like the Lou isn't even shooting at our mid. Okay, maybe he didn't have to because of the Okay, do we get the kill? Pop out like another super, maybe. Or attack the thing that's killing me. Oh, that should be a kill. No, Nani. got no pulls, like Buster. Oh, he does. I don't know how I saw it, that he had no pulls. Oh, oh, that was, he could, he should have just, like, hit him. They do have eight gems, because they've got the two in the back. Aren't, they are going to pick him up. Oh, we kill him there. He's on four gadgets, though. He's got countdown. Um, don't know if we can really reset here. Do we have time? I think we have time if we stay back. I think we get two jump spawns here. Alright, we do get the second jump spawn. Now if we just back up, we should be fine. Alright, I'm just gonna keep shooting here. If we grab that, we'll start a countdown. Oh, we get two pickups. I think we're good. No, I think 15 will spawn. I still want to get stunned somehow. Back up. He's got no pulls though. We just keep shooting at him and then pick up this gem, we're good. Yeah. Like, Buster's good into M's, but only for a little bit. Like, once he runs out of the pulls, or I just break. All oh, the bushes are broken. He can't really do anything. I'm glad my teammates are listening to me on the lanes. Like, sometimes you just get the teammates that never listen on the lanes. Like, like these are the best lanes possible, because. I want the spike on the Tara. You want me on the Buster. I'm just gonna try and pressure him away. Slowly back him up. Alright. It's fine. Just keep him, keep him occupied here. Yeah, this is definitely gonna be much better in the like, beginning lanes. Like, I won so fast, and then once he's out of the bushes, there's no speed gear, no like invincibility. We're fine. And then the Tar is just going to get destroyed in this lane. And if he doesn't have super, then the Buster doesn't have much chance in the spike either. You need to be very hard targeting me <laughs> and not my team. Interesting. Not the best super for me. Kind of trolling with that. Alright, solo pull? Okay. Not again, not again. Like, how are you going to solo pull me and still get traded? That can't be happening. Like, what is it with these this lob these lobbies and like why are they just targeting me? Like, <laughs> I have a gem carrier and they're using all their supers on me. I'm not even gem carrier. Like, surely this like more productive, a more productive use of your supers. Like, I know I, I know I'm so super good at the game. But, like, I'm not that. Good. I'm joking. I'm joking. Yeah, that's what you get for solo super me like eight times. Yeah, three and thirteen. Maybe don't solo super me and still die or get traded. Whoa, big elo. All right, well we're very close to being back to legendary three. We've got like a huge win streak right now. I think this is NA because I'm pretty sure everyone on our team is NA. I think Cosmic's NA, so it should be NA. Should be, should be. I don't know if Jacko has Charlie, so I'll just ban it. Like, I gotta look at the profiles and like memorize who has Charlie so I know whether to ban it if we've got first pick or not. 
They didn't ban it, so they definitely have it because they wanted to get it. So if Jacko does have it, I mean, Nani on Ring of Fire is like so questionable. Like, it's an open map, you get no zone time when you pick it. Like, I've seen it lose so many times. I mean, the hypercharged spike first pick, it's like random's favorite pick, but it works because they know how to auto aim at least. So, who are they gonna go? They're probably gonna go Bell. Bell's a good pick. Oh, they're going Nani. Alright, I don't mind that. Especially because Nani into Spike is like such an interesting pick. My teammate wants Bow. Of course he does. This is like definitely double Mythic 3s right now. Bow is just such an annoying random pick. Like, they always pick it, but people learned how to trip Bow Mines. Although, to be fair, it's actually alright into Amber. Alright, we've got the Insta Lock. We're alright into Tanks. I think I'll go Buster now I can't because they they have Rosa if I go Buster. I think I have to go like a tank counter or something. Counter stinks. I think I'll go Buster actually. Or Maisie. Well, too late. I wanted to go Maisie. That probably would have been better because Maisie's pretty good against all of them. But, it, oh, okay. That saved us. That saved us. I don't mind the bull as much as the Rosa. If they had picked Rosa, we'd definitely lose. But I don't mind the bull as much at all, especially in hot zone. Because we already have Spike. Is he asking me to change gears? Or is he asking the teammate to change gears? I don't have like 80 gears on all my brawlers. I have two for almost all of them. And I have like three on like Griff and Stu. Alright, we've got two mids kinda. But Spike should go like mid slash left. Stop a bull. Alright, well. Three kill there. Alright, plus that. Insta control. Oh, I was hoping to like dodge the sides, they got less shots off, but it's fine. Like, if the Nani isn't hitting every shot. Alright, that was such a wasted gadget by the bull, because he could have just gone into the wall and. Not god, you like st stop next to me, but. Alright, that's two bull gadgets used just on me. But I mean, you don't really use it on a crowd unless you've got like a really good lineup. I feel like once we get the bull gadgets out of the way, I don't mind the matchup we've got. Alright. Am I alive here? Actually, yeah. He's dead. I'm alive. Great commentary there. Insightful. Bad gadget though. Okay, horrible gadget by Bull though. That made mine look good. Alright, um... Free kill there. Oh, Bull's out of gadgets. It's like a fish out of water. <laughs> I don't know what he thought was going to happen with that super. He should have just gone in like our spawn and hoped the Nani or Amber gets a kill. Hit the side of my thing. I feel like a good- I feel like they should like rework Buster. Like, he's just- he's not even that fun to play and he's just so unfun to play against. Like, it would be so much better if instead of three seconds where you can just hold it out, you can like whip out like a 30, like a- half a second block or like a one second block that you can just like quickly go back but he charges his super in like two hits like like almost like stew like that'd be so cool if it was like a like you could just quickly block something instead of instantly getting full control of it I remember everyone said he was dead after the uh super time nerf and like obviously he was but it was more because of his damage than his all right <laughs> he's just dead that's fine Nani, interesting aim, interesting super. If we're all sim together, the bull can't really charge. Hey, give me my super, give me my super. This, yes, like, this is just so unfair. You know? Like, and his range is, like, weirdly long. It's like, need a range. Watch him gadget me. Yep. Very fun. I hope he dies to the bow mines. That will be so funny. He did. He got hit by all three of them. Actually, maybe not the first one. And I instantly get zone control. 
full insta kill. Like, plus is just so good. I think if they go Rosa, they might instantly win. But like, Bull doesn't even beat Buster sometimes. Great hyper charge. He's got no chance. See, blame the bull. Yeah, it's your fault. Blame this guy. Yeah, shoot at him. Everyone give him kudos. Come on. No? Am I alone here? Alright. Star player though. Nice. No, I don't want to play with you. Um, We've got almost there. I think that's two games, maybe three, depending on like if we get underdog or not, like the hidden underdog. We made some pretty good progress today, but I sort of tilted it like off camera. But that's it for this one. Thank you for watching.